When it's springtime in Indiana, one of our favorite things to do is visit the Helen Link Daffodil Gardens at the Dr. Goth Link Observatory in Morgan County. When the grounds are in full bloom, you'll experience a vast sea of daffodils. That's a sight to behold. Today, we're going to speak with Ruth Pellock of the Indiana Daffodil Society. Tell me a little bit about the uh, daffodils at Goth Link Observatory. All right, the daffodils have been there uh, since I'm going to say the 50s uh, when Mrs. Link uh, first planted a, oh, just a, a num small number of them in clumps. Uh, they, Dr. Link and uh, Helen Link owned this property for a while before moving out from downtown Indy. The following spring, they were just gorgeous. So she bought, Dr. Link bought her about a thousand more bulbs and she proceeded to come out to their property and planted them with the help of a caretaker. And from there on, they just multiplied and she created cultivars and the place is just gorgeous. What year did they start planting and how many varieties are there? I think they probably started in the uh, 40s planting um, and Mrs. Link herself uh, has 48 cultivars attributed to her name. What happens is it takes about six, seven years in order for a cultivar to produce. So you start with the seed, you get the bulb, plant the bulb, you get the flower, you wait a number of years for it to grow out to make sure that it's hardy and dependable. And of course it is gorgeous to look at. And then, and then you can say, it's my cultivar and you get it registered. So this is maintained by the Indiana Daffodil Society and you're part of that. Can you give me a little, you know, history on the Daffodil Society? Okay, but first, uh, the American, Daff American Daffodil Society is like a mother society that was formed in 1954. And a few years later, someone said, why don't the states have their own society? So, the Indiana Daffodil Society came into existence in October of 1956. So yeah, we meet various places in Indiana. So uh, we try to gather members from all over the state. Now, do you guys have events throughout the year? I mean, most of the time people think of daffodils in the spring, but do you guys have events throughout the year? We do. We have a show in April. And after that, we sell bulbs at the uh, state fair. And then we have bulb sales in various places, um, Bloomington and Nashville. And I think this year we're gonna be some, doing something up in Indianapolis. Well, thank you so much for joining us. This was very interesting and we love daffodils. <laughs> Me too. For more information on the Indiana Daffodil Society, click indianadaffodilsociety.org. And for more information about the Dr. Goth Link Observatory, contact the Indiana Astronomical Society. Click iasindy.org. For Great Day TV, I'm Barney Wood. <laughs>